Welcome to this day and everything cool for March 12th. This day in the year 1894 was a day to drink to. The very first bottle of Coca-Cola was bottled at a candy factory in Vicksburg, Mississippi. The Coca-Cola company had been founded a few years earlier with the goal of creating a beverage mixing carbonated water and cocoa beans, but it took a few years before they got the formula just right. Coca-Cola took off and soon sprung countless imitators, creating an entire new market of soft drinks. The fact that Coca-Cola didn't have any alcohol meant it could be marketed and sold to children, and it was also extremely addictive thanks to its use of refined sugar. Over the course of the last century, the Coca-Cola company became one of the biggest corporations in the world. On March 12, 1999, a big video game franchise soared onto the big screen. The Wing Commander movie, based on the space combat games of the same name, was released in theaters worldwide. Like the games, it told the story of futuristic humans locked in an interstellar battle against a race of cat-like aliens and starred 90s heartthrobs like Freddie Prinze Jr. and Matthew Lillard. Unfortunately, the movie sucked. It was universally panned by critics and audiences rejected it as well, making it one of the biggest box office bombs of the year. Wing Commander helped establish the dreaded video game movie curse, something that really hasn't been broken to this day. Hopefully, that will change soon. March 12, 2008 was a huge day in the advancement of online video because the video streaming service Hulu launched in the U.S. The site was created as a joint venture between big online entities like Comcast, Facebook, and Yahoo, along with content creators like Disney, Warner Brothers, and Fox. The idea behind Hulu was to create an online alternative to traditional television with audiences able to easily and legally watch shows and movies online, with users paying a subscription fee to access shows rather than watching ads like on television or other video sites like YouTube. Hulu has since been made available in other countries, and pretty much every big studio is rushing to create their own online services. 